Greetings to those of you who are members of the Hopewell Missionary Baptist Church, New Market, Alabama, and also to some of our friends who are part of this e-news communication as well. I want to first of all thank you for your response to the family need on Sunday. In just a few minutes, we were able to meet a need in the life of a family. While we don't always have the control over how things happen, we certainly thank you for your response to that need. And it allowed many of you to uh, respond. So many people will be blessed because of your intention to share and to sow into that family's life. There are also going to be some communications later, what I understand from that family, in thanking uh, the members of our church for your generosity. Then also we have another great opportunity with our young people on this coming Saturday. They're going to be sharing with the Agape Seventh-day Adventist Church in Huntsville, Sparkman Drive, 3200 Sparkman Drive at 11 a.m. They're going to be bringing the song service there, and then adults are welcome to share with them also. So let's support them, let's encourage them, let's pray for them as they will go for them to serve and to share in our community. Then also, we do have another opportunity on the 31st, on Tuesday, May 31st at 7.45 a.m., Hopewell will be sharing breakfast with the uh, homeless community over at First Stop Incorporated there near Derrick Street in Huntsville, Alabama. That'll be next Tuesday at 7.45 a.m. So please make plans to be there. It's open to any church members who want to attend and just encourage the homeless over there as we go forth. We're going to have some other opportunities to do that as well, which will be communicated in future uh, e-news um, updates. And so please be on the lookout for that. Then also be mindful that in the month of June, we will resume our Sunday morning discipleship hour. Of course, on first Sundays, initially, it'll be a 15 minute in-person Sunday school review following corporate intercessory prayer that begins at 9 a.m. The Sunday school review will begin at 9.15 a.m. It will be live in the sanctuary each first Sunday. And then from there, we have our various classes on the second, third, fourth, and fifth Sundays until further notice. I also want to encourage you to continue to, uh, I know we're still in that place, but to continue to wear the mask while we're present on campus and continue to follow the protocol that's been put in place because we're hoping that we can get through this wave that we're going through right now with COVID without any incidences. I pray, I praise God for what we have been able to enjoy so far and we're thanking him in advance for what we're going to be able to continue to do as we remain vigilant in this uh, cause to uh, combat COVID. We do pray good health and strength to each of you. We do ask that you keep in prayer those members among our congregation who are going through in the loss of loved ones. We have several families right now, uh, one just fresh yesterday, and we certainly thank God for his mercy in the midst of what we're going through. But let's remember each of those families in our prayers, as well as those who are battling sickness and other illnesses and, and other issues that are taking place in the life of family. It is not easy in this season for anyone. And so we certainly want you to know that we're praying for you, praying with you, that God will strengthen your family. Also, each Sunday as we gather, we certainly are thankful for those who are in place to keep the contact tracing and to take the temperatures and those who are in place to do various things. We thank each of you for your role and your position and posture on Sunday morning to help us get through this season that we're in. May God bless each of you as you go forth in this day and know that we are certainly thankful for the blessing of being able to be together. Also, I want to say this. On Wednesday, every second and fourth Wednesday now, we're back with our midday Bible study. That means the next one will be next Wednesday, uh, May 25th. But every second and fourth Wednesday, we're back with our Bible study on, on midday in person in the sanctuary. And then also first and third, we still have first, third and fifth, really, we have our uh, moments of meditation. And then each Wednesday at 6.30 p.m., we do have in-person, on-campus Bible studies and life groups. And then on Thursdays, we have various life groups, singles, grief, uh, various ministries. Find a place, connect, grow. Let's grow together as God would bless us in this season. So many more things I could say to you today, but in the interest of time, I'll say God bless you and continue to keep working for his glory.